Yeah, she's been missing for almost a week now, and the search is growing much more desperate. Everybody's been hoping that Rachel was somehow able to make it to a lookout tower there along the trail where she could be warm before the weather moved in. But today we learned that when crews got to that tower, there was no sign of her. Fog, rain and snow have hampered the rescue efforts for days. Somewhere out here is 28 year old Rachel Lackaduck. She left Moses Lake last Thursday telling her family she planned to hike the Hidden Lake Trail to this lookout cabin, spend the night and then leave the next afternoon. But she hasn't been heard from since. These summertime snapshots from the National Park Service don't do the landscape justice. The terrain is steep and rugged. The first rescue crew got to about 6,000 feet before fears of an avalanche turned them back. Another attempt yesterday. This time, workers got to within a few hundred yards of the lookout, but again, weather forced them to retreat. Everyone had been hoping Rachel made it to that lookout cabin, and with word that she apparently never did, Skagit County Undersheriff Chad Clark says people need to learn from this. You just got to be really careful. You got you to gotta know your limitations. You got to you know, you, you gotta know what your experience is and that you are alone and cell phones probably don't work up that far. Um, so I think I think that's probably with the weather. It's just a whole bad combination of things. On her Facebook page, Rachel's mom posted that crews will begin looking for her daughter's body tomorrow. However, under Sheriff Clark says they are not giving up hope. He says a Navy helicopter and some search dogs and other crews will be out there tomorrow looking for any signs of life. In Cedro Willie, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.